I mean, it's Thomas Twitter. What more do you expect? So last week, Lionel announced that they are going to be making a brand new remote control Thomas set. Cool. Uh, you know, like, I mean, I personally can't say that I've been a fan of Lionel's work. I mean, their Percy model looks okay, but frankly, every other character looks like complete garbage to me. And I've also never had the chance to own any of the Lionel stuff because it's just you know, non-existent here in New Zealand. And trying to import it from sites like eBay or even Amazon is gonna set me back like $400. I'm sorry, not happening, not happening at all. And at some point down the line, Lionel also came out with this remote control battery operated Thomas, AKA a ready to run set. Uh, I mean, I don't technically think this was classed as a model, but because it was made by Lionel, I think people just accepted it as a model. Yeah, it had these like really awkward, ugly, uncanny sort of emoji-like faces and they were all happy. Where was the grumpy expression? Where was the sad expression, the surprised expression? I was scrolling through Twitter and wouldn't you know it, I come across a post that details that Lionel is coming out with a brand new ready to run Thomas set. However, this new remote control battery operated ready to run set from Lionel is based on All Engines Go. It's, it's the All Engines Go Thomas. And people are just f***ing losing their mind at this sh**. Well, <laughs> I've seen so many comments and posts that are basically saying, oh no, Lionel is done. They've fallen off. They've ended their Thomas career now. People were looking at the old models thinking, these were so good. Why did you change to All Engines Go? They're not good, bro. <laughs> Seriously, these things aren't good. And if you think they're good, then I'm sorry, you're just wrong. Nevertheless, so many people got so upset with Lionel simply because this was an All Engines Go Thomas. Personally, I was waiting for the day that a model train company was going to make an All Engines Go Thomas. And the fact that it's a really nice sized O-gauge model that looks like the character, comes with three facial expressions. Yes, okay, they, they may all just be sort of smiling expressions again, but they look like the show. It looks like the Lion Chief controllers. I'm assuming it would have sounds. It comes with Annie and Clarabelle, so you get the, the main trio there. They look like the source material. And the thing fucking puffs steam. Now correct me if I'm wrong, but have any of the other Lionel Thomas models ever been equipped with smoke mechanisms? If they have, then please tell me and I'll admit I'm wrong. But as far as I'm aware, this is the first Thomas model to be equipped with smoke. Okay, I say smoke. It's just a water vapor sort of thing. So it's water vapor that looks like smoke. Think of like the old metallic Tommy Thomas, the way that thing smoked. That's how it's gonna be for this new Lionel model. And I'm sorry, but this model just looks really f***ing cool. Thomas looks accurate to how he's portrayed in All Engines Go. So do Annie and Clarabelle. The fact that people are still hating on All Engines Go in 2024 just absolutely baffles me. Like, they're expressing their pure hatred for this model simply because it's All Engines Go. All Engines Go is nothing new anymore. It's been around for, what, three, four years now? And if you can't accept that All Engines Go is here to stay and is now a part of Thomas's history, I, so, I don't know what to say to you. All I can really say is just leave people alone. Like the amount of abuse I've seen online in the last few years for people that defend All Engines Go or because they like All Engines Go, they get so much hatred. And I'm just like, this is not what the Thomas community should be like, you know? And coming back to Lionel with this new All Engines Go Thomas, there's so many people hating on it, but thankfully there's also a lot of people who are absolutely praising this thing. I've seen people say that if Lionel was to make Percy in this style, SHUT UP AND TAKE MY MONEY! Looking at these photos, it... That is All Engines Go Thomas. It's got some really cool features. It looks like it's gonna be a nice model. Even the track layer you get, like this is a really expansive layout for a ready to run set. You get points, you get a crossing. This is sick. And I really want to buy one of these. As of now, these are on for pre-sale on Lionel's website. And when I went to look at it and try and pre-order one, it told me that I was unable to do so because I didn't live in America or Canada. <coughs> Why is it so damn hard to get some of the best Thomas merch? I really would love to own this. 
This would be like what I'd consider like the perfect Christmas tree train. You, you know, you put this under your Christmas tree, Thomas is chugging around, he's steaming around. Oh, it would be perfect, but unfortunately, I personally would not be able to get this without spending a very large amount of money and that's just something that I'm not prepared to do. I'm just hoping that it turns up on Amazon for a good price. But at the end of the day, this looks like a fantastic piece of Thomas merch. Like, say what you will about oil engines, go like I don't personally mind it. I, myself, love the merchandise. I don't really watch the show unless there's like a returning character. But the merchandise for the show is so good. Like, you're telling me you wouldn't buy these All Engines Go men's pajamas? Of course you would. Look at these things. Look at the packaging. Like, for All Engines Go stuff, this is incredible. And it's for men. It's for adults. Like myself. I'm nearly 28 years old, and I have my now favorite pair of Thomas and Friends All Engines Go pajamas. I'm gonna do a video about these at some point, so look out for that. There's also these railway series themed boxer shorts. These together come from a place called Peter Alexander. They did a collab with Thomas and Friends. Railway series and all engines go men's pajamas and boxes. They're making adult all engines go stuff. I would personally class this new remote control Lionel Thomas as an adult piece of merchandise. So this is new adult Thomas All Engines Go merchandise. Yeah, there we go. This is adult Thomas and Friends All Engines Go merchandise. Just like these official Thomas and Friends men's pajamas from All Engines Go and Peter Alexander. Boom, I don't care what anyone says. All Engines Go and Thomas and Friends as a whole is for adults. But as for my final thoughts about the new Lionel Remote Control All Engines Go Thomas, holy shit, that was such a mouthful to say. I am so sorry. I personally, would love to own this. It just looks right. Its features sound amazing. And for someone like myself or anyone really, I feel like this would be a perfect introduction to the Lionel series. If you've never really experienced the proper O-Gauge Lionel models or any of their ready to run sets, this would be a perfect starter set. God, I just wish I could get this. Like, if anyone would be able to help me get this set, I would arrange something. I'd arrange something with you. But do I think that Lionel is stepping in the right direction doing All Engines Go stuff? Yes, of course I f***ing do. I really hope they start doing this with the regular O-Gauge Lionel stuff. Because anything they've produced for All Engines Go is going to look f***ing ten times better than what they produced previously. Have you f***ing seen James? <laughs> but I want to know what you all think. Write down in the comments below your thoughts about the brand new Lionel Thomas. Do you like it? Do you hate it? Let me know down in the comments. Be nice to one another. And until then, I will see you next time. I'm going to go and play with my trains, and you should too. See you later.